Hello, hey guys. So I have my head kind of wrapped today. Um, it probably looks bad, but it probably doesn't look as bad as it would if I didn't have it wrapped because I'm trying to grow my hair out and it just looks terrible. Um, so hi, kitty. Hello. Are you gonna sit here with me? So I'm gonna be doing a couple book reviews today. I'm gonna try to get these uploaded. Pretty busy. First book review I'm gonna do is gonna be The Barking Ghost by R.L. Stein, another Goosebumps book, one of the classic series. This number is number 32. Uh, this book came out in, see the copyright date, 1995. This book is, let me see, I think it's like 117 pages long. All right, so. I'm gonna make this review pretty quick, pretty straight to the point. I sit here and think every single time if I wanna tell spoilers or not. Um, I think I'm gonna try to do a spoiler free review on these Goosebump books. Um, so this Goosebump book was pretty cool uh, up until the end. Uh, and anyway, it's about uh, this kid and he moves into a new house and it he's kind of from what I understand his brother always makes fun of him and they kind of joke and, and anyway he meets this new girl that lives in the woods near him and her name's Fergie and well they call her Fergie I think that's kind of a nickname and Fergie uh doesn't like dogs and Cooper which is the kid that moved into this new house he hears dogs barking um, he hears things moving he sees shadows so it's kind of like eerie and it's kind of this new house and it's creepy and so for he meets Fergie in the woods one day because he's just gonna go out exploring and it's kind of cool it's really cool setting it's in the woods and uh, I just I like to be out in the woods so I like the setting and everything and uh, so that being said, he meets Fergie, and Fergie's like, oh, you know, says something about the house being haunted. So, first of all, what are you doing? Come here. Hey, come here. First of all, he is kind of freaked out because he's seeing all this stuff. My husband always calls in the middle of my videos. Every single time. I cannot make a video and have my husband not call so if i want him to call maybe i should just start recording because it happens every single time or if i'm washing the dishes my husband ends up calling so i don't even know i'm super foggy brain today and uh i lost my train of thought because he called but yeah he's out in the woods meets fergie fergie's like oh your house is haunted and something about dogs and she doesn't like remember saying it and then he finds out later that his brother put Fergie up to scaring Cooper because Cooper has an older brother and I think I mentioned that earlier and he is like always scaring him and stuff and I think Cooper I forget how old Cooper exactly is if they say it in the book or not but Cooper is definitely older like more teenager and Cooper's brother is more teenager guys if you don't know why I'm um, spacing out and being all foggy and bouncy um i have something called pots and i try to do these book reviews and you'll see how bouncy and spacey my mind is um let's see i don't really know what else to say but that's pretty much it cooper brother fergie um they're all jokesters and um cooper's hearing dogs at his new house anyway this book was really, really good up until like the last several pages and then it was really bad. Um, just, they could have done such a better ending and they didn't. Uh, I was very disappointed in how the ending turned out. Uh, I did watch the movie uh, version of this Goosebumps and it was a bit better, um, but still it, it totally could have been a a better story um very disappointed in the ending cover's cool i like the cover um i don't know i don't think black labs are very scary but the red eyes are kind of creepy but 
Anyway, other than that, my cat is curious as to what's going on in the video. This Goosebumps book, I would probably rate, rate it. Um, not the worst one that I've ever read, but definitely, definitely disappointing ending. So, anyway, I'm going to let you guys go. I'm super foggy. I'm um, going to eat some breakfast because I haven't done that yet. That might be my problem. And uh, I'm going to get out of here. Sorry about the bad book review, but I also, like I said, I have thoughts and uh, my brain jumps. So, bye guys.